So I've been feeling pretty lonely lately and I need a new adventure. Alright guys, so we just landed to Bulgaria and I already met a new friend, Jonathan. And uh, we are actually going to the same hostel, surprisingly, and we're gonna split the bill. And on the way, even met two more people who are going the same direction. So we're all connecting together and they're going to the taxi now. So Jonathan and I just got out of the hostel. We're going to look for food to eat. And he's vegan, which is a huge problem. <laughs> just kidding. What is your first impression of uh, Bulgaria? First, second impression. <laughs> first, second impression. I don't know, it's uh, grey. Full of um, taxi drivers running. <laughs> uh, Jonathan, I found your dinner. Hello. No uh, English? Yeah. Or Spanish? Jonathan and I are in a date right now for our first one. So we just ordered uh, hummus. We came all the way to the homeland of hummus, to Bulgaria to eat hummus. Okay, so this is the hummus, finally arrived. It's very small, right? Rather, yeah. <laughs> Out of ten. Five and a half. Oh, really? Wait, I was about to say four. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. This is day two in Bulgaria. And this is a face of somebody who barely slept two hours. My first impression of Bulgaria so far is that everything looks so old. Like the buildings are not renovated and everything looks like it hasn't been touched in years. Look at this building. Or this. So we are literally walking in a historian site right now. Look, I'm walking with my two feet. Imagine my future wife is watching me right now. I need to fix my hair. Give me a second, guys. What? I'm just fixing my hair for my future wife. This is Saint Sophia. Guys, I feel like in Bulgaria, time literally stops. Today, I woke up at 8 and I saw my roommates in their bed scrolling through the phone. And then I went to the kitchen and I saw somebody eating with a bowl and I told her, good morning, da 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 da. Okay, cool. And then I go on and start my day. I go to the city center, I go to the mall, I do shopping, I go to the museum, I sit by the fountain. Anyway, five hours later, I go back home to the hostel. I go to my room, they didn't move an inch. They're still scrolling on the phone. And when I went to the kitchen, the same girl was sitting in the same spot and in the same bowl. Like, literally nobody moved a single bit. And I was like, wait. Did I just freeze time or what's happening? Is this like a Bulgarian thing? I was so confused. So anyway, I spent the rest of the day going through all of Sofia's touristic attractions and later that day, I went to eat pizza. It's really good. It's really good. <laughs> oh god, that's a 10 out of 10 pizza. Just... There's a girl employee that I went into her store by accident because I thought it was a pizza place and then she told me, no, it's not the pizza place, and then she told me, where is the pizza place? And she was so pretty and so cute. And now I'm thinking to keep her a slice and ask her, uh, I tell her that I saved it for her. Hopefully something will happen. <laughs> and then I had one of the most unforgettable romantic things that ever happened to me. But I will keep it to another video. <laughs> So I ended the day by watching Forrest Gump with my hostel buddies and that's about it. The day was over. Okay guys, I'm saying goodbye to the hostel. This was my bed for two nights. I didn't sleep so good. So now I booked an Airbnb which I will have to go in four hours. So I'm gonna go look around the city, kill four hours and then go to the Airbnb, which is pretty far by the way. But yeah, I'm excited, I'm excited. I wanna go rest. <sighs> okay, so on the way to the Airbnb, I had a lot of time to kill. Bro just lost 200 ELO in chess. Understandable. So I asked this guy to take a picture of me with the cathedral. Can you take a picture of me? Uh, <laughs> nice, thank you, dude. 
So anyway, on the way to the Airbnb, I got stopped again by the police and I got questioned of what I'm doing here and who am I with and where I'm going da, 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 da. And this is not the first time it happens. Every single time I go to Europe, I get interrogated by the police or the FBI, but it's okay. I kind of got used to it by now. Every time I go to Europe, I get questioned every single time. Maybe here we can find out Victoria's secret, guys. <laughs> So after walking for two hours straight, I finally arrived to the Airbnb. But unfortunately, sleeping in this Airbnb was actually very horrible because it was way too loud. Every single second of the night was very, very loud. Many neighbors, many cars, and many explosions, which I'm not sure if it's guns or fireworks still to this day. Every single time somebody walks on the street, I think they're, they're walking in my, in my room. So I kept waking up to see like, what the hell? Am I in the street, you know? Like, am I still in bed? But the good news is that one of my viewers, which is also a very good friend of mine, is from Bulgaria and he accepted to meet up with me the very next day. Every single person that I see, I keep asking myself, is this Roran? Is this Roran? Like this girl, for example. Roran, is that you? <laughs> in case people wondered where I parked my car, here right in front of the cathedral okay any person can be him and i think i see him there i honestly don't know how he looks like oh wait actually that's a girl maybe that's him he's walking there to my direction he's smiling is that him roran <laughs> dude i'm guessing who's oh my god you smell so you smell so nice oh thank you, thank you. <laughs> hello this is roran he is my uh, crush for 10 years, but I, I was afraid to tell him this whole time. So what's your uh, reaction? So you came just to meet me because I'm your crush? Yes, wow. yes. Uh, I'm kind of creeped out. I came all the way. <laughs> Yo, so good to see you. Do you live like close here? Yeah, I'm close by. I, oh. I wasn't checking my DMs or anything. I thought you were going to ditch me. I was like, wait a second. I thinking, are you hungry? Dude, my last meal was yesterday okay, at 2 p.m. We are gonna need to walk around, so. It's fine. Do you have any good place? Of course. All right, so we just arrived to uh, Roran's favorite restaurant. It's gonna be my first time in years of eating meat just because I want to experience his favorite food. And I said, I'll make an exception. I told you, you don't have to. I want to, I want to. Like, it's my choice, don't worry. <laughs> Wait. Fix my hair, most importantly. You know, in case my future wife is watching. Okay. So I have to make sure. So, we just got our drink. I did take a sip already. Never mind. Dude, good. Okay. Oh, you're fine with cheese and stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, you like banitze probably? Banitze? Yeah. Is this still English? Alright, guys, look what I just got in front of me. It looks so good. It smells so good. Oh wait, that's your smell. You smell good. <laughs> okay, moment of truth. No, I'm an Arab. I eat with my hands. Why don't you tell me to use a knife? Mmm. <laughs> so this is how it tastes like. Stay with me and then you're <laughs> I don't know if every restaurant here is that good or it's just your suggestion. It's not just me. <laughs> you're uh, revealing to me all Bulgarian gems, hidden gems. Sure. Wait, uh, if your name is Roran, what is your last name? <laughs> <laughs> Roran is uh, the gamer type, you know? And, uh... Wait, it's not your real name? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what's your real name? Wow, well, someone online is not using their real name as your name. Wow, it's crazy. I'm Alper. Huh? Alper. Alper. Yeah, Wait, so it sounds like Albert in a way. Yeah, a lot of uh, people are working on my phone now. So. Oh, okay. Let's dox him, guys. Uh, Albert what? <laughs> I'm following the leader. Where is he taking me? I don't know. But I trust him with all my trust. The last mistake you make. <laughs> My mom is watching, just to let you know. <laughs> what is this here? This is the Sofia University. You can go to the front. Maybe I will study here, just to have an excuse to migrate. 
This is where you're supposed to laugh. <laughs> Am I a funny vlogger? Very. I wasn't paying. Stop spitting facts, bro. Honestly, like, whenever I go out with somebody or something, usually I feel like the camera ruins all the vibe, you know? But then again, then again, whenever I go back home, I'm like, I really wish I can watch what we just did and stuff, you know? So, yeah, I mean, for example, with the girl story that I told you, imagine I had a camera. It would not work, you know? So, I didn't, I didn't film. I didn't film. <laughs> I, I, prior I prioritized the girl over footage. Wait, can you tell them what you just asked me? I just asked, uh, what is your name, by the way, Fadi? <laughs> can't believe you don't know it, really? I thought you were a hardcore fan. Sure. It's Jacob, bro. Jakub? Jakub, yeah, in Arabic, Jakub. <laughs> I'm kidding. Jakub or Jacob? I'm kidding. My name is Fadi. Oh. Okay. My actual name is Fadi. Really? Yeah. Okay. This is my pet I forgot to tell you about. Oh my god, it's so hot. This is my pet, I forgot to tell you about. Oh, we're so hot! <laughs> Don't burn yourself, man. Careful. Um, why is he not moving? Why is he not moving? He did. I think he's dead? He did. <laughs> okay, I just got my two souvenirs. This is homemade by this lady, and it's very cheap. And I picked one for my mom. I don't know why are you like the, this one? The colors and the the guy, the girl. Mm -hmm. Ah, I think because, because the girl is Asian and I like Asians. Is she Asian? I think it's like supposed to be Bulgarian. Oh, really? Yeah. Is this free? Free? No money. Do you do I get break careful? I know. No, 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 no. What if I win? If I win, can you tell him if I win, do I still have to pay? Casa aku kopita. He's not that confident. Ah, okay, okay. No, no, no. Only free, only free. I will give you my friendship. No, 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 no. Roy is afraid of the almighty fairy flashy on chess. By the way, I suck at chess. This is where the actual good guys are. Oh, there's more, dude. Chess hustlers. And then I saw this really cute library, and I was like, I got to check it out. Hello. Isn't she hot outside? Uh, like inside? Like it was so. Yeah, the girl was hot. The girl was hot, but I mean, <laughs> the place was really warm. <laughs> Guys, look at this amazing spot we found. We found a bench in the middle, in the middle of the supermarket. How do you like the game? <laughs> Roran, I have a surprise for you. Thanks, Fabi. Can we do another take? What do you do? Oh my god! Yes, yes, yes! No way! No way! I mean, I'm, I'm kind of out of fake in emotion. I'm sorry. <laughs> double it and give it to the next person. <laughs> and then Roran and I went to get some ice cream, and then we had to say our goodbyes. We are saying goodbye to Roran. But I have to say something before going. I started saying it off camera and I said, you know what, I'll say it on camera. When I messaged you, I didn't expect you to be like, oh yeah, sure, let's meet up tomorrow. I expected you to be like, either ghosting me or making excuses. Like the other people I want to meet. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's up to people and you get first them. If they don't want to meet you, they don't want to meet you, you know? Yeah, of course. But you're like so flowing, like everything. You wanna go, even when Yoyan told me you wanna go tomorrow again and stuff. So, you know, it's so, so friendly and open. I love it. All right, you fools. I just came back, I took a shower, and now I'm craving pizza. So, I'm going to get me a pizza, and maybe some groceries on the way, and then, and then I'm gonna go back and eat the pizza in the Airbnb. Yes, 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 and then I'll go sleep. Perfect day, perfect day. All right, let's go, let's go. Do, 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 do. And then uh, I got the pizza. Do, do, do. And I had a really good night. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay guys, we're entering the zoo. I just need to get the uh, tickets really quickly. One second. Uh, excuse me, tickets to the zoo? How many? Uh, wait, how, are, how many are we in the chat? Three. Uh, three tickets, please. 
Okay guys, I just got the tickets to the zoo. I bought you all tickets so I will not get cancelled, you know? I can't tell her I'm one person when I have three people watching, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Dude, is this a zoo or a monkey palace? Every single place I go, I see monkeys. I have enough mirrors in the house, guys. I don't need to look at any of these. Hello. Another monkey cage. Monkey. Where are they? I don't know. You know, I have a theory of sometimes you see cages with no animals inside. And my theory is maybe they died and they're lazy to get a new one. Or they didn't get a new one yet. They still keep the cage here thinking, oh, he's probably hiding somewhere, you know? This is watermelon. Oh my god, it's so cute. Look at this watermelon ice cream. Guys, do you want to play a game? I will hide, you have to find me, okay? I know all of you cheated. I saw you and you and you. All of you cheated. Oh, here, here I can, I can be a monkey and stuff. Hello. Bro is in, in a diet. All of this failed, guys. For these pigeons right here. They got a VIP cage. If I was here with Man Eater in real life, I would wait for him on the bench and he would play here. Guys, my last, my last lick. That's what I will never say to her, by the way. <laughs> Guys, my hands are so dirty from the ice cream. I can't bear it. <laughs> oh, he's holding something in his mouth. I'm doing good, how are you doing? I'm doing good, did you just call me a man? Damn. We're upgrading Light Flash. Usually you call me a dude. What's up, dude? Now we are, what's up, man? Oh, it's a baby. Giardone, this one is more like Giardone. I think my time here at the zoo is over after this. Alright guys, so today we are leaving the Airbnb because we're going to a new city called Plovdiv. Now this looks like the Harry Potter trains. Has anyone seen a toad? So on the train to Plovdiv, I met two amazing Englishmen and remember them very well because something is gonna happen with them later on in this trip. Alright, so I just arrived to Plovdiv and um, I still don't have a hostel to be honest. I'm going to the city center and the first hostel I will see there, I will ask them. That's my plan for now. First impression is it has a lot of shadow. So that's, that's a good thing. But I still need to see the city center first. So the city center was actually incredible. There were a lot of nice sceneries there where you could just sit there and relax and have a good time. They have like a mini game. Oh, I'm playing. Oh, I'm shooting. <gasps> And I even found a mountain where you could climb it and you could see the entire city from above. I love these people. The gang is just sitting there, hanging out. And I even found a place where people gather there and play chess for the whole day. And you guys know how much I love chess. Guys, this is a very touristic place because this here is the ruins map in PUBG. <laughs> And then I stumbled across some really cute kitties. Oh my god, so cute! Look at this cutie! Look at these cuties! Oh my god, I want to feed them. Hello. Um, do you have small cats? Yes. Small, small. Yes. See them now here on the street. Are these? Yeah. I'm feeding them. Don't ah, you're feeding them? Yes, okay, of okay. Course. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> good to know, thank you. <laughs> okay, that was good to know. But they are getting fed, because I felt so bad for them, they were eating from the street. And obviously, my hostel experience was horrible. People kept farting and snoring the whole night, and I just couldn't sleep at all. Alright guys, we just said goodbye to the hostel. It was a really nice one. But I re always have a hard time sleeping in hostels. So now I booked an Airbnb and I'm on my way there. I met this guy from London. He was so, so nice. And before I left, he was like, no, don't leave. Stay one more night. So he made me feel so likable, you know? So I, I, I'm I, feeling really good about it. <laughs> okay, so I finally arrived to this new Airbnb and the place was actually really good. Do you guys know what I love the most about this Airbnb? The host is like, all right, this Airbnb is for tourists. They're coming internationally from all over the world. I need to give them house rules. So the first house rule is... The first house rule is... Bruh. So anyway, then I got recommended to go to this really nice hiking spot and 
I brought my stream with me. Oh, we have, we have arrived. All right, we are on top of the mountain, guys. We are on top of the mountain. And then, if you remember I told you to remember the guys from the train? Well, this is where I see them again. Oh my god, it's you guys! What? <laughs> Dude, I saw you guys in the train! <laughs> what are the odds? Dude, whenever I came here now, I said there's nobody here. Yeah. If I gotta see somebody, I'm gonna be terrified and I'm gonna be so impressed. <laughs> How aren't you guys sweating? I'm all sweaty. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, we're living in a stimulation. These people, I started with the train. This is... What are the odds? What? <laughs> Bye guys, enjoy your time. Bye-bye. <laughs> so this is a statue. Ah, dude, even looking up is kind of scary. I have a huge fear of heights. <laughs> I'm thinking what to write to Nuni as a gift. And I found this. Like markers, cute ones. I'm thinking to get her also this one, the cactus. Dude, Bulgaria is supposed to be very cheap. But these things, very few things I just bought, costed me $35, like USD. That was insane. Like even in my country, it's way it's cheaper. So today I'm going to a new city. And on the way, I met this really amazing guy, which we talked the whole way about really deep things like life and really serious conversations. Dude, first class, I feel fancy. Yeah, super <laughs> I just had the best conversation with uh, a person. He is such a nice person, so everything was so, so, so nice. I really, really, really love interacting with people. This interaction right now made me want to meet even more people. <laughs> okay, guys, I just arrived at the Airbnb, and oh my god, it's so good. Look. This is the living room, the window to the park. Dude, I love this place. There's a sword on top. What? And here's the bedroom. Guys, I don't know why, but I feel like I already have and own my own family. Like with kids and everything. Like look, I'm eating now, uh, spaghetti. And in this huge table, two with one, two, three, four, five, five people. Look, dinner is ready guys. Itadakimasu. I'm waiting for my family members to come. This feels so different compared to the other places I've been to. I don't know, it's a different kind of feeling. Like I feel more adult here. <laughs> or something like that. Dude, I just slept. And there's this one mosquito which kept biting me the whole night. So... I'm gonna prepare for next night now, and I know how. Okay, so anyway, this new city is called Patharthik or something like that, and there is literally nothing to do here, but I tried to have fun anyway. I asked the pasta owner, what is the best place here to visit as a tourist? And he told me this place. So if this is the best place, <laughs> in this city, <laughs> I love sports. <laughs> I love sports. This is so random. <laughs> this is so funny. How it's so bad. <laughs> Everything here. I do not know what to write. I'm like, oh, everybody loves sports. I love sports. My Boba obsession continues. We are in the movies. Got myself popcorn. Ugh. Oh my god, such an amazing movie, damn! No way. Widescreen? No way. This is too much CGI. So anyway, spending three days here made me feel really lonely. So I decided to go back to Sofia and only spend my time in hostels because I was lacking a lot of social interactions and I don't want to feel lonely anymore. There's so many people here, guys. But I am best friends with Doris. Doris, we are besties, best buddies. <laughs> and I'm so glad I found this hostel because I met a lot of new friends. Okay, so today is the most social day I've ever had in my life. So, it all started by me going to the lobby with a chessboard and asking every single person if they want to play. So I found this person who wants to play checkers and a person who wants to play chess. His name is Owen. And yes, his name is actually O Wine. I've never heard this name before, but I promise I'm not mispronouncing it. I also met Dominica and Olivier, which I talked to them the most. And later that night, we all gathered up to go to the pubs together with a bunch of us from the hostel. All right, first time in a pub. This is the crew. Oh, you must say something for the camera. Oh, 
I, I kicked Fadi's ass at chess. Okay, I'm not, I'm not gonna include this in the video. <laughs> so we are here at the pub with the crew and Olivier has something very important he wants to say right now. <laughs> so Dominica just confessed that she stalked me and she saw my YouTube channel and she said uh, that I'm so handsome in the videos and she wants to marry me. Uh, oh, thank you so much. I didn't know you. I didn't know you feel this way about me. <laughs> and after an hour in the pub, I was like, all right, this is very tiring. We're probably going back home. But no, they want to go to a second pub. Pub number two, we're going to get drunk on water. Whew. Can't wait. And after another hour in the second pub, I said, all right, it's 1.30 a.m. There's no way they don't want to go back home. Guess what? They want to go to a third pub. Pub number three, let's go. Two Danish girls against each other. So far, this is better than the Euros, if you ask me. Yes! Wow! Okay, and then finally, they don't want to go to pubs anymore. And I was like, yes, finally, we're going back home. But nope, they want to go to a club now. Like. Bro, what? So anyway, I said, all right, that's it. This is my limit. I'm going back to the hostel. You guys enjoy your time. So on the way to the hostel, I met yet another friend, which happens to be my roommate, and we talked the whole night. Here we go, here we go. Bro is playing Doom in 2024. I will only film you without sound, and then I'm gonna put the voice over. And then I met this amazing guy. He's from Australia, and he's traveling the world. And he went to Egypt many times. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It's day 11, I believe. Yesterday, I had the best night of my life here in Bulgaria. I met so many people, like around 15 people. And by meeting, I mean like meeting, meeting. Like I know everything about them. I mean, I came to Bulgaria literally to meet people. And this is what I'm doing. So today was a really fun day at the park. We gathered all around and we started playing games. <laughs> Mr. President, do you have something to say? I won two times in a row. Three times, no? No, the okay. first time I, I won. Second. <laughs> okay. This is a rematch. We are 1-1. One, one, and this game decides who is a better chess player. We all know it's me, but maybe I'll lose intentionally so he'll be happy. I mean, oh, did you hear that? <laughs> like everybody left the group already and we're still here sitting at the park eating and playing chess and chatting. Excuse me, sir. Can I join you? Sure, yeah, yeah. I'll need to give you ice creams. Oh, you're, you're, it's your lucky day. I got you one. Cheers. Oh, I went to chess.com, started analyzing my Queen's Gambit and now he wants to beat me. Are you ready to beat me? I think so. Yeah, I think I've always been ready. I need to <laughs> test out comfort that. Oh, Wayne, if you had a chance to choose between one million dollars cash right now or how do you your wristbands? What would you choose? Obviously, the wristbands. Yeah. Good choice. Good choice. Good choice. Cancel the one one million dollars, guys. Go back. <laughs> You did the right choice. What are these? Now this will give you luck if you wear them. Oh yeah. Yeah. And this is why I've been winning all the chess matches. Damn, who is this? Dude, uh, you're single, right? Yeah. You're not gonna be for a long time, yeah, I'm sorry. Is. Yeah. yeah. This is gonna get you all the girls. That's, that's what I hope for. If you get a girlfriend by tonight, you know why. Yeah, yeah. The flashy wristbands. Exactly. And guys, Link in my bio if you want to buy one. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm not even selling them. I'm not even selling them. I just give them away. <laughs> pick a color. Thank you. Now pick other colors because I want to get rid of them. <laughs> okay. Alright, so now because it's uh, for the vlog, you're going to be like, Oh my god, no way. <laughs> oh my god, no way. I totally didn't expect it. I know, right? I know, right? You're welcome. We're in the shock. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I was losing to Owain the whole game. Look at the position. He's trapping my king. And I'm literally gonna die from all of this. And boom, I found this move, knight here. And now it's checkmate in one. And he has nothing to stop it. After all this suffering I've been through. This is why you never give up, guys. And look at him crying. 
Oh, one, it's okay, it's only a game. It's only a I game. Know, there's, there's a way out of, out of this. Uh... <laughs> he didn't give up. He still thinks there's hope. Dude, I think bro is fine. Alright, we're saying goodbye to my besties. Bye, guys, I love you. to my previous friends in the hostel and now uh, I have a new friend he's, he's a paid actor I paid him to be my friend How you doing? What's your name by the way? Uh, Steven McSteven His name is Steven McSteven Right now we're going to eat a burger It's a place called Hell's Burger I came here for uh, in the morning for breakfast and coming back again for dinner Do you find it we're used to it. Can I order a veggie burger meal? What's your favorite burger? <laughs> I work in KSC, five years. <laughs> you hate them all Four now? Four years, I have no favorite burger. <laughs> <laughs> you like them all, huh? Everything is bad. I don't like them. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I, I like to eat home. Oh. Are you ready to rate it when we eat? Sure. It's very important, the whole world is going to see. Whether to eat here or not? Uh, uh, sure. They should pay me for, for sponsoring them, to be honest. We will rate it on our Instagram. Yeah, if they pay I have, me... I have, I have half a million followers. <laughs> half of them are from Bulgaria. If you want, if you want a high score, you should pay me for the meal. Yeah. That's what I have to say to them. 17 hours later, we finally got our food. What happened to yours? Ah, it's a tortilla, I think? It's meant to be a kebab. Oh. It's good? Yeah. I told you I recommend the best places. It's got special sauce in it. Oh, nice. Guys, don't go to McDonald's. Go to Hess Burger. Cheaper, better, and better. Lawrence, out of 10, rates the meal. Uh, Cost-wise, it was really good. It tasted good. I'm, I'm sort of, I'm pretty full. They had yeah. a healthy option. They had um, the apple juice. Yeah. And they had um, straws, paper straws. So I'll give it a, I'll give it a solid seven. Seven? Really? Damn, I expected way higher. All right, they recognize this place right there. Probably not because it's too dark. But here, earlier today, I played with my uh, besties from the hostel and now they're not here anymore. They're back in their countries. <laughs> I'm actually a very emotional person. Whenever I get connected to people, I care for them too much. And whenever I can't, I can't see them anymore, I get like emotional, but not crying emotional, you know? Like, yeah, just like, oh, I don't want to go out anymore. Yeah. Like I finally, I finally met people that I really like and now I can't see them anymore so it's kind of a sad feeling. Like I, I might not even see them at all in my life. Yeah. <sighs> Is the same gonna happen with you by the way? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably by tomorrow. It's, it's... Go to a new hostel and uh, yeah. make some new friends. I don't know. Yeah, it's sad. Look at this amazing view guys, I've never been here at night. The vibes, the music, the scenery, tourists, living life, beautiful girls. What else can you ask for? Dude, why is there a dog in the middle of the street? Hello? Oh. Get up, this is not the place to rest. Hey, no, come here. Come here, come here, come here. Not in the middle of the street. I kind of want to buy him food. Woof, woof. Nah. Nah, nah. Nah, 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 nah. Okay, he's afraid of me. How do you call a dog? Maybe he's just had enough. No, no, no. <laughs> Wait, sorry, I can't leave him like this. Yes. Wait, maybe I'll scare him so he can go the other direction. Oh, oh it's working. 
It's working. Uh, it's working. It's working. It's working. <laughs> it's working. It's worked. Took the bait. Yeah. I'm saying goodbye to this hostel. And I'm going off to the next one, which is actually the first one which I took here in Bulgaria. It's because they accept PayPal payment and I don't have cash with me, so it was my only option. Hello, cute cat. I came to say goodbye to you. <laughs> I came to say goodbye to you. <laughs> Guys, the gate is open, but nope. Need to leave. Need to leave by the door, guys. Hello. Hi. Yeah. Hello again. Hi, yeah, I'm back. Nice to see you. Yeah. <laughs> I know this is so random, but I'm so triggered by the numbers of the beds. Like, this is 242, 243. Now, where is 244? Where? All the way here. Why? 24 okay so maybe here 24 20 45 no 41 what why is it so confusing like like this is the right order one two three four like why not like one two three four five six i found another victim <laughs> to my chess game and so far Bro said he barely plays chess <laughs> and he's beating my ass and I should have known. I should have known. I should have played white. <laughs> <laughs> Man, the, the... Hello, 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 can you hear me? All right, all right, all right. Wait, we're getting content here. Uh, excuse me? The Alexander Cathedral, where is it? 20 minutes by... Uh, 20 minutes? But I'm long, so it's gonna take 15 minutes. Yeah, it depends. And uh, walk... Straight, maybe. I need to walk straight. Metal. Yeah, uh, you walk straight to the church. Oh, what you if know. I'm gay? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> By the way, guys, I'm not actually gay. It was only for the for the joke. <laughs> I had to clarify it just in case. Oh, you know what we should do? We should go to like a traffic light and we see which people will cross when it's red light, and then we film them on camera and boom, straight to the police. Yo, this girl passed in red red lights. Arrest her right now. Hello, my friend. What's your name? Sorry? What's your name? Sorry? My name is Fadi. Are you from India? Uh, yeah. Yes. Yeah, how did you know? <laughs> I know everything. What's your name, by the way? Sergo. Sergo, nice to meet you. I'm yeah, Fadi. One left to you, my friend. One left? Here. Here. Thank you, my darling. You, you use it, a, use it on a... food though, on food. No cigarettes, no drugs, only food. I don't make drugs. Okay, no, good, no. good, good. He doesn't make drugs, he takes them. <laughs> Shut up. Guys, last meal in Bulgaria. We got the famous omelette with chips and everything inside I like. I'm eating here with Lawrence. And Lawrence is crying right now because I'm gonna leave tomorrow. And you're gonna miss me so much. It's okay, bro. We can keep in t we can keep in touch. Stop crying. Okay. <laughs> yeah. How do you feel uh, now when I'm leaving? Something deep. Something deep. Why well, put me on the spot, man? Um, we've just been through so much together, and uh, um, it's just gonna be a hole in my heart. Damn, you're doing a great job. Keep going for a few minutes. <laughs> 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 dude, you're so good at the camera, I better than I expected. <laughs> Thank you, dude. It was nice to meet you. But well, it's not over. The Fatty X Lawrence saga continues. <laughs> We're saying goodbye to Lawrence. Goodbye, Lawrence. It was nice to meet you. Love you. He didn't say it back, guys. He didn't say it back. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Guys, I can feel my journey being over. I said goodbye to my last friend. Sad times, sad times. But we keep moving on. So I spent the last night watching the Euros at the hostel lobby. And that's it. My journey is pretty much over. <laughs>
Bulgaria is probably one of my least favorite countries I ever visited so far, because the landscapes and cities didn't quite resonate with me. But I still managed to come back with a lot of unforgettable memories, and it's all thanks to the people that I met along the way. Whether it's the friendly locals who showed how kind they are, I'm feeding them. Ah, you're feeding them. Yes, okay, of okay. To the amazing travelers, which reminded me of how much I love people. So. If there is one message I really want to deliver in this video is that as somebody who dealt with social anxiety my whole life, I can genuinely tell you that it does get better the more you try and you will eventually get over it because there are a lot, a lot of nice people waiting for you to meet them. If you miss the traders, you wanna say hi?